Hey Crossword fans! Today we're going to be solving the New York Times crossword for Monday, November 14th, 2022. Alright, let's get started. One across the A of UAE, that is the United Arab Emirates, so that's going to be Arab. Alright, let's see if we can build off of this. Consumed no cooked food. I guess that would be eight raw. And it has to be eight in the past tense because consumed is in the past tense in our clue. And the tenses in your clue and answer always have to agree. Turn clockwise or counterclockwise. I guess that'll just be rotate. Warp drive power source on Star Trek. Hmm. Um, isn't that dilithium crystals? I'm letting my Star Trek nerd show a little bit. It starts with an A? Hmm. Oh, it's gonna be antimatter, that's right. Nice, okay. Coffee tidbit, that'll be a bean. A coffee bean. Okay, we have a bunch of things filled in here. Let's just confirm that these are right. Watch your tone, attitude check. Yeah, that's right. At last singer, Etta James, that's right too. And after hours bank convenience, yeah, that's an ATM. Like a bad day for a picnic, say. I think that's going to be rainy. Yeah, that would not be a good day for a picnic. Polite affirmative in the south. I think this is going to be yesum, short for yes ma'am. List ending abbreviation. I think this should be etc. 1990s fitness fad using karate moves. Yeah, that was Taibo. That was all the rage for a little while. Some quality cigars. I don't really know much about cigars. I think I've seen Claro on a puzzle before in reference to a cigar. Let's see if it's Claro's. Yeah, it has to be plural because they're asking for cigars plural. Something unimpressive slangily. And it looks like this is a theme answer. It's pointing to a revealer down here. Something unimpressive slangily. Is it going to be weak sauce? Ooh, so maybe this is Cubans instead of Claro's. That's another kind of cigar. Okay. Weak sauce. That's a nice entry. That's very colloquial. Uh, okay, so that's our first theme answer. Let's see if we can build up towards another theme answer, which is probably going to be right here. A lot of the time, the long across answers are going to be your theme answers. Word with shaving or sewing. Hmm. You could have a shaving kit or a sewing kit. Yeah. Is this a theme answer? It doesn't look like it, actually. They get diffused in some action films. One hopes. <laughs> Is this going to be time bombs? Nice. Okay. That gives us a little bit to work with over here black card suit. Okay, well that has to be either clubs or spades, and clubs is the only thing that fits here. Center of activity. Is it a hub? Let's see if that's right. Change from Jason into a Power Ranger, say. <laughs> well, they were the mighty Morphin Power Rangers, so I guess they have to morph, right? That's quite the blast from the past. West Coast NFL player informally. Okay, so there's only a handful of teams on the West Coast. It's not a 49er. Maybe it's an LA Ram. That fits in very nicely. Baton Rouge School. This has to be Louisiana State University, right? Swiss Peak could be an Alp. We just learned the name of a new Alp the other day. What was it? Finger Arhorn? It was something like that, yeah. Jump blank. Double Dutch Equipment, that could be Jump Rope. Alternative to Visa or MasterCard informally. That's gotta be Amex, American Express. So we have slow-mo, playback option in brief, that's right. And this is gonna be another theme answer. High society metaphorically. This has to be upper crust. So we have upper crust, weak sauce, that's very interesting. I'm noticing that these two things kind of have something in common. They both look like they have 
ingredients for a pizza on the end of them. Yeah, crust and sauce. I wonder if we're gonna have cheese and maybe toppings or something? Yeah, let's see if that's right. Blows up, that's gotta be explodes. Flashing light at a concert, that'll be a strobe. Dull sound of impact is a thud. Slide into, and when you have a word in parentheses at the end of your clue, that means that same word needs to be able to go at the end of your answer. So I think this is gonna be ease into. Mental resourcefulness. You gotta keep your wits about you, especially on the crossword. Okay, so we have stew, hearty one pot meal, that's right. And Thai, cuisine with Tom Yum Guy. That sounds right to me. Okay, finest efforts. Hmm. It's efforts plural, so I think this is gonna be bests plural. Okay. One in nursery school? Is that just a tot? A small child? Letters spelled out with rocks on a desert island in cartoons. Yeah, that is SOS. Pigeon sound, that's a coo. The A of BA. That's a Bachelor of Arts degree, right? I wonder if we can get this long down here. Image captured with Shift Command 3 on a Mac. Oh, I use that all the time. That is a screenshot. Nice, that's great. Okay, Pennsylvania in DC abbreviated. Well, there's a famous avenue in DC named Pennsylvania Avenue. That's where the White House is. Okay, Blank Rica. That is Costa Rica. Bronte and Dickinson for two. Well, there was an Emily Bronte and it's Emily Dickinson. So this will be Emily's. Disgusting. And these quotation marks mean we need to come up with an equivalent phrase. I would really want this to be blech. <laughs> That's a fun piece of fill there. Stay, please. And this is another equivalent phrase. That's gotta be don't leave. And look at this. We said we might be seeing cheese in one of our theme answers, right? What is this looking like? Smile. Another equivalent phrase, yeah. That's gonna be say cheese. Nice, okay. So let's finish off this corner and then start working down towards our revealer. Sailor's hello, that's ahoy. So we have show. Dexter error for short, yeah, that's showtime. Sidekick of Mario and Luigi, that's Yoshi the dinosaur. Birds that can twist their heads almost 360 degrees. Those are owls. Sound of a fly swatter. Hmm, I don't know, is it whip? I'm not sure. Tales passed down through generations. That's gonna be a lore. Big fan in modern lingo. That is a stan. Yeah, that's also very colloquial. Okay, largest hot desert in the world. It's looking like that has to be the Sahara. Life-saving device for one with severe allergies. That is called an EpiPen, yeah. All right, so what do we have here? Nap, take a midday snooze, that's right. Rocks, Joan Blank and the Blackhearts. That is Joan Jet. Okay, what choosy moms choose according to ads. Choosy moms choose Jif. Yeah, that's our Peter Pan rival from yesterday. Obama blank, 2009 to 17. That was the Obama era. And we have Iyer, Wrath, yeah, that's right. North Dakota City, that's the title of a Coen Brothers film. Ooh, yeah, this is one of my favorite movies of all time. This is Fargo. Even though most of that movie took place in Brainerd, yeah. Okay, many a TikTok user informally. Hmm, I wonder if it's gonna be a Gen Zier? <laughs> that looks a little strange. You'd better believe it. And this is an exclamation mark clue. That means we have to take this clue literally. So this answer needs to be something you'd better believe. I wonder if this could be dogma. That's something you'd better believe, right? That's pretty good. All right, let's start working on these acrosses. 
revolutionary maneuver in sports or breakdancing. And this is a wordplay clue that's indicated by this question mark here. What you have to do with wordplay clues is look for a punny answer. So this is not gonna be about a new groundbreaking maneuver. It's probably gonna be a pun about a maneuver where you'd have to spin around somehow in sports or in breakdancing. Hmm, I wonder what that's gonna be. It's not a head spin in sports. Hmm, yeah, I'm not sure. I think it has to be something like that though. Ingredient in some skincare products. That should be aloe. Here's a brief summary in internet speak. That is too long, didn't read. Okay, petty fight, that's gonna be a spat. Little clump on a sweater. Uh, what is that called? Is it a pill? I'm actually not sure. It is looking good for P here. It looks like this could start with spin. Maybe it's a spin move. Yeah, there we go. I think this is a pill. And is this gonna be a Z? I'm seeing a pizza start to form here. Preppy clothing brand, yeah, that's Izod. Let's finally take a look at this pizza we've constructed here. Social event hinted at by the ends of 1828 and 48 across. Yeah, what is that gonna be, a pizza party? That is a lot of fun, yeah. That is a perfect Monday theme. Very, very nice. Start getting paid as an athlete. That is gonna be GoPro, just like the camera, I guess. Self-absorbed could be vain. Gaelic language. That's gonna be heirs. Yeah, that's a Celtic language. Brewed beverage. I think this has to be tea. And fashion monogram. That's gonna be Yves Saint Laurent, so that'll be YSL. So that would give us rises. Hemingway's The Sun Also Rises, that's right. And this should be O'Neill, the big podcast with Shaq host. Yeah, that'll be Shaquille O'Neal. Nice, yeah, I guess it's a big podcast with a big host. <laughs> All right, well, let's throw this L in there and see if that'll do it for us. All right, a Monday puzzle in a very respectable 1836. That's great. I really enjoyed this Monday puzzle. This had a lot going for it. It had this really fun build your own pizza theme. Each of our theme answers ends with a pizza ingredient, crust, sauce, and cheese. And we get a fun revealer too, pizza party. There was also a really nice variety of clues. I love that we got to see an exclamation mark clue today. Those are kind of rare. You'd better believe it for dogma. That's a good one too. And also we got a wordplay clue for spin move, revolutionary maneuver in sports or breakdancing. That's great too. We got some equivalent phrases. I think black is probably my favorite. And there was just some really nice long entries. Antimatter is great. The Star Trek nerd in me really loves how they clued this. We also got explodes and time bombs. This is a very volatile trio of answers. These were really fun. All right, well, thank you for coming to my pizza party. I hope you enjoyed solving that Monday puzzle with me. I'm going to be coming back at you tomorrow for the Tuesday puzzle. And I think that's going to do it for now. All right. I'll see you next time.